lot guys, my name's Shane O'Brien, I'm the assistant coach of the Gold Coast Suns. Today I'm going to show you around our facilities and uh, hopefully you can see what the boys have been doing over the last few weeks to get themselves right for the, the upcoming pre-season. As you can see it's pretty tough being a coach or a player on the Gold Coast. We have the canals in the background with a nice breeze coming off them and then to our left we have a sitting area where we have barbecues frequently with the admin and all the players sitting around and enjoy each other's company. Then when the work begins, we head up this direction where all the, the players, facilities are with the rehab and all the sitting areas and where they have their meals and the gym. This is it guys, this is the engine room where all our young guys get it big for the upcoming season. In here they do a number of repetitions of weights, do all their rehab work, all their proprio and all their boxing to get them big and strong and fit for the upcoming season. Now we're in the facilities of the rehab, physio, massage room where a lot of the guys come here for today's game, you've got to be professional, have a number of massages and see the physios frequently, but hopefully we don't have to see the guys in here too much this year. Uh, this is normally where all the banner starts with all the Gold Coast players. Um, hopefully in years to come we'll be able to put a few guys' names in the lockers with uh, 100 games under their belt. Uh, as you can see, it's a pretty clean room. It's probably one of our values around here to keep, it, keep our facilities clean so everyone gets the best out of them. On May 28, the Gold Coast Suns will play in their first game right here. The ground itself will have a capacity of 25,000 people. We're hoping all you Gold Coast Suns fans can sign up and be part of the history making game. I hope you've all enjoyed the tour because all the Gold Coast Suns players and admin have enjoyed the journey so far and looking forward to May 28th.